A UTSA lecturer caught selling fake Adderall. It's tonight's big story. Yeah, she was one of two people arrested, and tonight students are reacting to the federal arrest and the tens of thousands of fake pills recovered at a nearby apartment. The night team Steven Cavazos with a story. UTSA grad student Allison Siramonathan says she woke up from a nap and saw something she couldn't believe. I see DEA agents, I see two helicopters up in the sky. I'm like, maybe something serious is actually happening. And all right outside Ventura Ridge Apartments off Presidio Parkway. A federal search warrant led to the discovery of tens of thousands of fake Adderall pills and manufacturing equipment. Rose Rodriguez and Brandon Sims were arrested this afternoon. You don't expect your neighbor to be busted for selling drugs or even making drugs. Rodriguez, a UTSA lecturer, the university releasing a statement saying she's been suspended effective immediately. The DEA calls it a long time investigation into the selling of fake Adderall, which they say was being made from meth. Adderall in any college setting, I believe it's a thing, you know. UTSA senior Stephen Flores says he's never used Adderall, but knows other students who do. People are trying to pass their classes. People are trying to get good grades. Make the parents proud. Which is why he's shocked a faculty member from UTSA is now in federal custody. It's not something you expect from the people who are supposed to guide us to our future. Now, the DEA does add the amount of pills that were discovered is concerning, especially because students across the country use Adderall to help with their studies. Charges for Rodriguez and Sims will be announced at a later time. Steve?